Thanks for watching my video. This is Tiffany from Hong Kong Tiffany Tape Company. In this video, I will show you how to calculate the diameter for jumper rolls and for finished rolls. Here we have two examples. One is bob tape, jumper roll size. Another is PVC insulation tape, finished roll size. How to get the outer diameter with this information? Here we go. We have an exam, uh, an Excel. In this Excel, it can give us the diameter automatically. Let me show you how to do it. First, for bob tape, 50 micro and this size. 50 micro is equal to 0 0.05 millimeter. And the length is 4,000. The diameter is 7,6,4,3. So just uh, pull down, it will be this number. The diameter for one jumper roll of bob tape is this size. For another example, PVC insulation tape, 0 .0 0 0.13 and the length is 9 meter. Paper, um, PVC, the paper core is 38. You can ask her your suppliers about the size of the paper core. And the thickness is also 3. Uh, and the pull down. Okay. So this 50H is the diameter for the PVC. And by this way, you can get any size you want, all the diameters. Um, with the diameter for one jumper roll, it's easy to know how many rolls we can put into one 20 feet container. For example, 20 feet container size is here. And we can just use the length, divide the diameter, the width, divide the diameter, and the height, divide the height of jumper roll. And we can know that in a 20 feet container, the quantity will be about 44 or 88 is our range. The actual quantity will be depend on the worker's te technique and uh, the space. Mm. And uh, how we can get this, ex mm. you can download the, the Excel from our website, company tiflitap.com, company blog, and find this article, then download from here. Any other question, just a new message to us. Thank you for watching.